All right, welcome to our fractal project. We're going to get started by showing you how to draw the basic applet frame for all of your fractals in this video. You can see right here that I have a blank box with a white background. So let me go ahead and get rid of this and we're going to start by importing a few classes. So we'll say import java.awt.color and we want to import java dot awt dot dimension and we want to import java dot awt dot graphics and we want to import java x dot swing dot j panel and then we're going to say um, public class fractal tree extends j panel. We'll be starting off with a tree fractal that you can then alter to make it look like roots or a long system. And then we're going to say we do our constructor which is public fractal tree and we'll need to pass in the panel width And the panel height, which you saw for before, which is like 2,000 by 2,000. And then we're going to set background. And I'm going to go ahead and do the basic white. So I'm going to do color dot white, and then I'll set my size. which is a new dimension. We'll pass in panel width and panel height. Okay, so that's it for that. So I'm going to go ahead and save that image, uh, that project. And I'll go ahead and make a folder in my fractal folder. And I'm going to call it fractal tree. And then later on, we'll be adding um, more code to this to actually draw our tree. Now we need to create our runner class. So we'll create a new file. And this guy is going to be called fractal tree runner. So I'm going to just do import java x.swing.japplet. I'm going to do import java x dot swing dot j panel and then public class fractal tree runner extends j applet and then um, I need my height and width, so I'm going to say private final int applet width is equal to 2000 and private final int applet height which is equal to 2000 and then private final, oops, private fractal tree um, graphic and private. Uh, I'm creating an instance of the tree I'm going to draw later inside my panel and then I'm going to do an instance of J panel call it applet panel and then we're going to do public void init which is for initiate that we use for drawing applets and then we're going to do graphic is equal to new fractal tree 
and we're going to pass in the applet width and the applet height and then we'll say applet panel is equal to new j panel and then applet panel dot add graphic and we want to do get content pane which is what goes inside the jpanel dot add and then we'll add the applet panel to it which is an instance of our jpanel and then we want to set size and this is where we're going to use applet width and applet height And that is it. So let's go ahead and save this. And we're going to call it Fractal Tree Runner. And we'll compile to make sure we don't have any errors. And we will run it. And here's our white background. So you could also change the color of your background if it's appropriate for one of your fractals. And in the next video, we'll get to drawing our actual tree fractal, which will go inside here in our panel. See you next time.